Hi everyone, and welcome to this episode of Tile TV. In this episode, we are focusing on applying a liquid waterproofing membrane. This type of product comes in a liquid form as shown by our installer, Chad, going up on a wall substrate in this example. These membranes are used to provide a waterproofing layer beneath the tile layer, but on top of the substrate layer. They need to be applied properly so that they will work properly. Chad is showing applying this membrane properly on a vertical installation. More than one way can be used to apply this membrane. It can be applied with a roller, or it can be applied with a trowel, or in some cases it may be able to be sprayed on. In this case, we've selected the trowel to apply the membrane. As you can see, Chad is using the flat side of the trowel to key the membrane into the substrate. If you're familiar with this type of substrate and many other substrates, there are small holes in the surface of the plane of the substrate. These holes need to be properly filled. That's why Chad used the flat side of the trowel to key in or fill those holes with the membrane. Simply doing that isn't enough. The membrane has to be applied at a certain thickness. Now Chad has shifted to the gauged side of the trowel. He's doing this to achieve a thickness so that the membrane can function as a membrane layer, a cured, dried membrane layer on top of the substrate and beneath the tile layer. As he applies the membrane, the liquid with the gauged side of the trowel, he's simply getting enough material on the wall for the ability to achieve the thickness required. That thickness is indicated on the instructions by the membrane manufacturer. The instructions can be found on their technical data sheet or right on the packaging. In this case, it's right on the side of the bucket. Chad has now applied enough material on the wall and he has primed the flat side of his trowel, meaning he's put some of the membrane on the flat edge of the trowel and he is smoothing it off, making a nice, flat, thick surface of the membrane. He didn't merely paint it on the surface, he applied a layer of membrane to the wall and to the substrate. In our next episode, we will show you how to check to ensure that you applied the membrane at the correct thickness. Thanks for tuning in and join us next time on Tile TV.